so I did a thing. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna this one's gonna be kind of like choppy I'm sure because I want to go ahead and get some pictures of it um, and I am going to video vlog record whatever <laughs> um, the actual unwrapping of it so I'm just gonna um, give you a close-up and then I will be back to finish it off hold on here's what I did y'all Oh, I'm so excited. But first I gotta get this all mess cleaned up. All right, I'll be back later. Bye guys. You're good. <laughs> I'm good. All right, so I got, I did a thing, and I bought, my husband and I bought um, a brand new embroidery machine. So exciting. So I'm just gonna wipe this up real quick. I took my sewing machine, my Juki, off. So I had to take the mat that went with it off. And in doing so, I just forgot to wipe this off. All right. Okay. Sometimes if you blow on it, it helps. So there's two pieces. This is just the embroidery arm. Because we had to take it out of the big, um, out of the big box because we couldn't fit it in my husband's car. This is where I get a little lost because I don't know what all these pieces are yet. But here's the pieces tray. So this is the cover for it. Here are some of the stuff. To be honest with you, it's a brother, so it's supposed to be a lot, a lot, sorry, I gotta dry it off. <laughs> so if, um, it's supposed to be very similar to the PE770, which is now the PE800. Um, you guys know that that's the one that ate my finger, so I don't have um, a whole lot of love for it, to be honest with you. Um, so I sold it and Oh my God. This is the, <laughs> y'all, this is the, so. I don't know what some of this stuff is yet. Okay, that's all my, that's all my ones. This is like, um, the caps for the thread, you know, just the overall. Oh, they included some, 
some scissors. That's nice of them, I guess. All sorts of stuff. Good to play with that later. a pin of some sort that you plug in. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. So I don't know what any of that is. You see the puppies are here. Because their dad is making a video. Oops. That's Terry you Luca. Was that too much for fix? So Terry is um, actually recording it. And oh, we how heavy was this box? Like, is it gonna be heavy for me? Heavy? <laughs> you don't want to pick it up. You might know. environment styrofoam y'all oh my gosh this thing is massive one two three oh golly y'all wanna get this ta-da look at this bad boy sparkles Ooh. Okay, <laughs> Gypsy's excited. You excited, Dip? <laughs> all right, so we're gonna keep all of this. Watch out, Luda. You know how we kept it for everything else? Wanna keep it just in case? You know what I mean? Yeah, okay. All right, babies, you guys are everywhere. you one thing it is <laughs> it's a whole lot heavier you can tell her dad's doing this because why are you watching that are you watching this okay because he takes pictures of the puppies Takes a village, guys. Careful, you gotta step on that side. Two hands, guys. It's okay, those are only the hoops. So this is a nine by twelve. This is a five by seven. And I bought a four by four. Got a, um, it's like a, oh, stabilizer. It's like, I don't know what that is. I've never seen a stabilizer like that before. I always buy mine in the regular sheets. I open it upside down. Has that new plastic smell? <laughs> Some bobbin thread, you guys know, in an embroidery machine. It runs very similar to a sewing machine, and in that you have to have a bobbin and a thread. An embroidery machine, though, you don't ever see the bobbin thread unless you look on the back of an embroidered item. Also, you have to use special thread. In, in a regular sewing machine, you can use regular thread, um, you know, very much something along the lines of a Guterman, or if you want to get really fancy, uh, Arfil. But when you do a 
bobbin for an embroidery machine it's got to be it's actually got to be bobbin thread it can't just be anything like you're used to with your sewing machine okay now this is very similar to the pe770 um you know you used to have to push the lever leave leave lever under here same thing here it just pops on she told me it would be really tight the first time i did it and it was um it already has a bobbin in it it's just like it's just like the pe uh, 770 which is now the pe 800. just pop it out wrap it around pop it back in same exact thing this one has a, a different needle threader but we'll go through that in a minute I don't know <laughs> where one is, but actually, is that true? We're gonna set this up a little differently as we get everything going. So I don't, I'm a, like a person, I don't like dealing with wires and cables. To me, this is it's just messy when we do it this way. And you guys know me and my messiness, I don't like it. Ooh, everything is so tight on this machine, which is good. It's supposed to be that way. All right, you ready? Y'all ready for this? I am excited. Ta -da. Look at that. Look at that. What? Wow. Is that a new one? guys so we'll do a, do a tutorial later I gotta figure out how to use it first it's supposed to be um, from everything I've read and also what the salesperson said it's very similar it just makes your life a whole lot easier two of the main things that are gonna be amazing for me is I can stretch it out a little further so I don't have to have my fingers this close so I'm not gonna break a thumbnail or finger nail I'm not gonna get a needle in my nail and um, it cuts all your jump stitches for you, which is awesome. So, um, welcome to the new machine, and we will talk later. Bye, guys.